He knew I was scared. He was like, Cause we both look back. You see me? I see him walk across there. I'm like, yeah, I see him right here. I'm like, what? <laughs> what up to my dogs? I am Leo Leah, also known as Lily Yours Truly, and welcome back to my channel. Any nigga, I be running in their pockets. I'm always any bitches mouth is on their favorite topic. Today I have a lot of errands to run. Oh shit, hold on. That's yours. Dang. Yeah, this my um. My hair, my hair actually came. Look at that. Hey, baby. Yeah, it just like we sitting in the car in the garage, and we seen a white man walk across the screen in the rearview mirror, and we was like, "What the?" And then he was, it was the way he was standing too. Yeah, he, he looked like, like a serial killer. Girl, I was gonna hit the gas on his ass. <laughs> They had to send a serial killer and they gonna get there quick. <laughs> okay. Cause he was like, that's good, eh? Yeah, that's good looking. that my hair here, so I can get my hair done tomorrow. No, that's for me. What? That I'm doing horrible with time. Why was my appointment at 12:30? Why is my appointment? Oh, today. Yes, the whole time to get this out of the that's why you was rushing to get out. Yeah, I'll be back. All right, dolls. So I had to make a stop at my mom's house to drop the kids off. Now I'm full. And I'm about to get ready to um probably go get my underarms waxed and try to get my nails painted. Let me show you what I made the other day. Okay. Because baby is going mm -hmm. to get um, a shape up. But that's my dad on the phone. No, I didn't. So my daughter suggested that I start calling y'all my friends. My friends or my friends. Like friend or something like that. She was like, or my lovely friends or friendlies or something. I don't know. Y'all gotta leave. Y'all gotta suggest something down below of what y'all think I should call y'all because I'm kind of, ooh, honey, I got to get off this damn camera when my lips is damn dry because that is ridiculous. I was just running out the house from my mama. I used to enjoy when I stayed with her, when I lived with my mama, and I would just get up and leave my baby. Well, at that time, I only had one baby, so it wasn't a problem, but now I got two. Um, and y'all know when y'all have two kids, people be acting funny. So if you got two or more... I know. I ain't, you know. I ain't. Okay, so I gotta figure out. I gotta figure out a name to call y'all though. But I'm on my way to the nail salon so that I can get my underarms waxed because that's why I be going to get my underarms waxed. And I know that I could really just shave my underarms, but I'm not because my um hyperpigmentation that was going on under my underarms has been getting a lot better i haven't been having that razor burn the it just it just feels and looks so much better and going into well next year 2021 it's gonna be next year it's gonna be 2021 i'm gonna be looking into getting laser i want laser on my bikini line i want laser under my arms um because i am sick of all this hair i grow I wish I grew as much hair on my damn edges as I do on my vagina and my underarms because your girl would be lit. I used to never like grow hair on my um legs and stuff, but drinking that damn Nutribirds every day got my hair just growing out of control. So I'm on my way to go get a wax. I feel like every time I told y'all, every time I get on the vlog, I'm on my way to go get a wax. I'm gonna go get a wax. I need to see about getting my nails painted and I need my toes painted. But this is my baby collar and I, I don't got no I don't got no um thing for in the car, so I'll be back y'all. just now leaving out of the nail salon i told y'all i was coming here to get um my underarms waxed which i did 
and I ended up getting my toes done. Um, I ended up getting my nails done, and y'all, I feel back to myself. Like, I haven't had my nails done in like two, three months, and y'all, I don't know if y'all can, y'all can see this, but this is my nails, and what it's look like. They're a little fat because I got them done here. You know what I'm saying? I usually go somewhere else, but honey. To me, they still cute, and they making me feel cute. It, it ain't nothing like that feeling when you get your damn nails done. I got my eyebrows touched up. So, with everything, my, my toes, my nails, my underarm, and my eyebrows, it was 145. So, I feel cute. I feel real, real cute, and I'm... Um, she wouldn't let me get my nails longer than this because y'all know the reason I wasn't getting my nails done is because because they were unhealthy. But she was proud of me. They had grown back a lot. I wish I would have brought my camera in. I really didn't know that I was going to be getting all this done. So and that's why I didn't bring y'all in. I did show y'all me like in the process of my pedicure and stuff like that. But I was just chilling, watching some YouTube while I was doing it. Um, and... Uh, on the phone with my baby so that's pretty much all I was doing now I'm about to go home we supposed to be on the road on the way to Atlanta at like 2 o'clock but we finna get on the road now and I still don't got no outfit for tomorrow which is the New Year's Eve event and I honestly don't know I honestly don't know. I'm really not even finna stress about it because I just can't. I'm not I'm not in the mood to be trying to go into my damn new year stressed out and push comes to shove, honey. I'ma just find something that I already got in my damn closet and just make it do what it do. And yeah, let that be that. But I'm finna pull off because I am kinda rushing. I'ma get home and then I'll check in with y'all later. All right, y'all, so I just got home, and like I said, when y'all saw in the car earlier, I was pulling out, and I had got my package from uh, FedEx, which is, which is just some hair from my company, but I hadn't ordered hair from my elite vendor in a while. I just been with my regular vendor, so this is some of my elite bundles, some boo van bundles. And um, I was wanting to get a bob, but let me see. Let's see. I haven't had a bob in a long time. And so I was like, dang, I need a bob. Look at these. Okay. They feel good. Yep. The bundles are full. It's going to be flowy. I still order too long. I order 14 inch bundles, 14 inch straight. Okay. These bundles yeah. can be found at lovelylooks.com. The link is in the description box to order you some. So I got these bundles. I got a frontal and I think I'm going to get a bob. But I've been kind of wanting a frontal ponytail. But I don't know. I've never had that. I've never had a frontal ponytail. So I kind of been wanting a ponytail. It really depends on what type of outfit I'm going to wear so um oh, I actually got I got two options for two outfits that I could wear at the beginning of the event tomorrow I got this white outfit that would be cute I can dress it up and make it real cute I might try those on later on tonight for y'all and let y'all see what I'm thinking about doing because that would be really cute with a bob and maybe a nice blazer or jacket over it. I got two ideas that I think I can go with for my New Year's Eve um, look, but then I have to have a look for the day party as well. So we got to do two looks for the New Year's Eve event. One for the um, people who pay for VIP and they just get to chill and mingle with us. And two for the actual, like, what we bring it in the New Year's in, in. You know, in, in. I said in, in. So, I got some thinking to do. But I'm hungry. I'm about to warm me up some of my spaghetti. And I think we are about to get on the road. So, we can go do what we got to do. And I'm excited. 
excited. I'm so happy my bundles came. Because my hair appointment is in the morning at 10 a.m. Period. She gonna be cute. guys so I am done washing my hair um I got dressed wash my face with my teeth all that good stuff and I'm always running damn late somewhere like seriously am I I know I have to work on it I say I think that was one of my new year's resolutions last year that I was gonna work on <laughs> and be on time but I gotta get used to waking up early again. I I have not been like a morning person lately. And it's crazy because I feel like I set all these goals, I do all this stuff, and I build it up only to not do the shit. Like, it, ugh, procrastination be real. That's why I said we taking that shit out of here 2021 because I'm not finna fool with that shit and let it knock me off my game we got so many goals to meet so much to do this year we cannot be wasting time procrastinating and then being late for shit like in disrespect that's like disrespectful to people's it's disrespectful to people <laughs> in a time because i know i would hate it if someone was late to me so let me put this in my GPS. I feel better this morning, though. Um, I feel so much better this morning. As far as, like, my mood. I just had been off, like, seriously. Yeah, that's 25 minutes away. Oh, shit. Okay, let me dry. Oh, my gosh. It say I'm going to be like 10 minutes late. I know on her thing. It say you can't be no lo lo longer than, no later than 15 minutes. But yeah, I woke up feeling a lot better this morning. And praise God to that. I just got to get control of my emotions. Like my emotions have been all over the place. I know I spent a lot of time um, feeling like... I did a lot of stuff wrong this year. Like, I I had so much success this year, but I still feel like I did a lot of stuff wrong. And sometimes I be letting my mind get the best of me. And I don't like that shit. Uh, it, 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 it. Okay. Yeah, I don't like that. So, let me get out of here. And then when I get on, like, a road road, then I'll come back and I'll talk to y'all. Because I really do want to talk to y'all about that. We can't let our minds get the best of us. So, let me get here. Because I don't want to be late. Yeah. 
I really need to get um, a mount so that I can sit y'all on it while I drive because if I sit y'all over here, then you too far down. And then if I sit y'all right here, it like, it slides. And then y'all just see in the back of the damn, like I can really sit y'all right there and it won't, it probably won't move. But y'all see in the back of the damn, the steering wheel in my screen right there. And that, that just ain't right. It might not be too bad though. I mean, hell, it can keep me from having to hold y'all right now. But anyways, I'm almost to my hair appointment. It's 9 59. It say that I'm gonna be there at 10 08. So um I text her or I messaged her and told her what time it say I'ma be there, which is nine minutes from now. So I'ma only be like 10 minutes late. I think at her policy it was like you can't be no more than 15 minutes late. So that's cool. But um, we got a lot of stuff to do today, you guys. It's New Year's Eve. So tonight is our New Year's party. And then tomorrow is our New Year's Day party at Blue Oil and Chattanooga downtown. I'm super excited about it. I'm getting more excited today. My outfit did not come and it got stuck. And I think that's what kind of put me in a sour patch ass mood. Because now I really have to figure out what I'm wearing. I didn't want to spend no extra money. Like I had it. I, I be like when it comes to New Year's and stuff, I kind of be planning out how much money I want to be in my account for New Year's. And then I plan to like quadruple or 10 times that. You know what I'm saying? So like um, shit kind of pissed me off. Ooh. And there y'all go. Shit kind of pissed me off because I didn't want to spend no money. But that's a part of procrastination too because I did only order the damn New Year's outfit two weeks ago. Ugh. And I've been knowing about, ah shit. See what I'm saying? I've been knowing about this damn New Year's party. So that's why procrastination is gonna be number one priority on my list of shit to change or um, for my new year's resolutions do y'all um do y'all like follow new year's resolutions do y'all set new year's resolutions like let me know down below i know a lot of people think it's cliche but for me i feel like we actually get a fresh start like we get a chance to um renew and start fresh like it's a whole new year so you can do things differently um and if you happy with where you at then hell you can just keep doing the same you know what i'm saying so for me it, it brings opportunity and it brings growth and i really want to get back balanced and i want to get my ass back in that gym because i feel like i can take my body to the next level and i really want to see what i do with that um at the end of this year so I'm gonna get my ass back in that gym. And I honestly want to eat healthier. It's not necessarily about like where I can take my body. It's about how healthy I know I need to be. And health is wealth, you guys. It's no point in chasing a bag and wanting to make all these millions and you're not gonna be able to live to see it. You know what I'm saying? Excuse me. So yeah, I just wanted to say that I'm almost there i'm gonna pick the camera back up once i get there and then i don't know if i'm gonna show y'all this process or not i'm gonna ask her if i can film and i'll probably show y'all a little bit um and then yeah this buddy y'all what about my crazy ass had the wrong address in my phone the whole time it done took me to a whole nother side of town like the whole time. Now my ETA is 10, 20 something. I just had to call this girl and tell her I'm finna be late. I'm gonna have to pay her extra cause I'm so, like I do not like that. I'm, I was already late, but bitch, not late, late. Like that's late, late. So, <laughs> I can't believe I did that. I kept on saying, you know how like you look at something? I was saying East Street and it was Smith Street, but I, I kept forgetting the, the Smith 
and just putting East. Oh my gosh. I'll be back. We be throwing money in a spiral. Every time the girl hear my song, yeah, turn around right into my, my hoe. She shit. Rotting me like a BMX, but she said the key is for dying home. I got two words like a rhino. It's a way you can buy home, but I better mention you with a slide door. Got to open up the slide door, so you can hear it. I know. Money keep coming in, I can't lose. Money keep coming in, I can't lose. Foreign girls in a tent, I can't. At the light, turn right onto Spring Creek Road. go home and beat my face of course and get dressed and drop these damn kids off but now you slay me of course and i'll be back next week hey all right y'all i look slow <laughs> Um, I am done with my hair. Well, I've been done with my hair for a while. I actually had to go all the way to my house, pick up my kids. Um, I stuffed some spaghetti down my throat because I literally have not ate all day. I was in that shop. This is my first sew-in in like two... Wait. <laughs> this is my first sew-in in almost four years. Yes, this is my first sew-in in almost four years years so um i forgot how time consuming it can be especially when you at a shop and you gotta sit under the dryer and all that stuff i'm so used to just getting my wigs and put me putting it on myself and stuff like that but i can definitely say i enjoy you know having somebody else slay my hair because it is definitely slayed so i will be coming back um all this year it don't matter if i'm in that month every two weeks to get my hair done because I am enjoying this and that way I can be waking up pretty. I want to wake up pretty every day in 2021. I feel like that's a goal. I don't got to wake up looking like my daddy no more. I can wake up looking like me. So um, now I am downtown actually about to drop off the thermometer thing that we check in temps with. I'm going to drop that off so that I can go home and get ready and yeah. Yeah, be cool or whatever. Whew, my head hurt, y'all. I ain't had a sewing in so long, but a bitch feel like she can go swimming and still be cute. <laughs> I ain't even finna start about it. Like, I feel like I can go swimming and still be cute. I ain't gotta worry about nothing detaching from my head. I might have to start back getting these sewings because it actually feels good. And this is a closure. Like I said, this hair is available for purchase on my site she only used two bundles in my four by four closure actually so the bundles were 14 inches i should have showed y'all how long they were that 14 inches came down like it was 20 inches on me so two bundles in a closure 
this looks really good so the link is below you can order you some love lay loves bundles if you want to okay um but yeah let me focus because i am downtown and people are out tonight on this it's gonna be a new year y'all it's 555 right now 555 is the symbol of change like big changes oh my gosh hello hello Getting off track. Um, um, good. Hey dolls. So welcome back. I am fully dressed and I'm ready to go. Let me show you guys my outfit. I just got done taking a shot. I took two shots. I took two shots of Don Ko. And baby, I'm already about lit. I ain't gonna have no time to smoke my reefer. Cause I only got a Rillo. But let me show y'all my outfit. Okay. Whew. Uh, let me move this. All right. So this is what your girl is working with. Let's zoom in so we can get some details. So I got on clear heels that I got years ago. I want to say from Fashion Nova or either Windsor, but I think Fashion Nova. Um, I got on this dress that I got from Edge last night when we went to Atlanta. And I got it in a size small. Sorry I'm out of breath, y'all. We've been doing a lot. So I'm going to have to be pulling it down all night because of my butt and because I'm a little thick. But my baby ain't complaining, so I'm good. But this is our entry outfit. Of course, I got my hair done earlier by Naya. I did my makeup. I feel like I slay. And here is better detail of this dress. It looks so freaking cute. I look so cute. I wish I had some double-sided tape because that's going to get on my nerves. Me pulling this down. Like, I want it to stay. I want it to stay just like this. Like, just like that. But it's one of the problems with being thick. I don't have to deal with this my whole life. Like, you can't wear certain things because of your butt. So all you girls who be wanting a butt, this is a, a thing you gotta deal Hello. with. You got some pasties or some tape? I just said I needed some. She was just talking about how she needs some. <laughs> Nigga, I 